Well, it is Detroit's preferred electrical contractor and a black 100% woman-owned business where your safety and satisfaction is the main priority. Here to tell us all about Detroit Voltage is Dina Neely. So, Dina, we're so glad to have you here with us. For those who don't know, what is Detroit Voltage? First, thank you so much for having me. Um, Detroit Voltage is an electrical contracting firm. We're headquartered in Detroit. Uh, we do residential and commercial electrical installation, repair, remodeling, and renovation services. Uh, we install electric vehicle charging stations, and we nationally distribute LED lighting. Okay, and you are a native Detroiter. You're bor born and raised yes. here. Um, where did this idea come from? Very random. I'll say I worked in local government. Um, for over a decade. Okay. And while working in buildings and safety department for the city of Detroit, I had an opportunity to work with contractors. And so I learned both sides of the counter. Um, never really thinking that I would be a contractor. I ended up marrying an electrician. Um, the relationship didn't work, but the company was birthed from that. There and you so go. Here we are. See, so something yes. something came out of it. Something, something great came, came out, out of it. it. And it's interesting because you saw a real need in the community, and that was your idea for for that business. It's kind of like the the, the seed that kind of sprouted. Absolutely. That. So as a born and raised Detroiter, um, I also saw that people didn't really want to serve the community, and I was more than happy to do so. And so I kind of found that niche and just roll with it. So if someone wants to come on board and work for you, I'm, I'm guessing the company has just grown by leaps and bounds Absolutely. through the years. Yes. Um, how do you recruit talent within the city of Detroit? So most of the talent is through word of mouth. Um, again, working for Buildings and Safety Department was just a great place for me to build relationships, meet contractors. And so that's always a lead for me. But outside of that, every now and then we'll post something on Indeed. But yeah, a lot of it is word of mouth. And how did the, the Great Lakes Women's Council, the, the Business Council, actually, you know, find you and, and form this partnership? I found them. Um, I was looking for a safe place where I could get some mentorship. And so I found Great Lakes Women's Business Council, and they have been the most amazing organization for me. I mean, they welcomed me open arms and have helped me along the way. So I'm in my eighth year of business, and they've just been dynamic. And how important is that when you talk about a partnership for women, for mentorship? And what kind of advice would you give other young women in the city of Detroit? I think it's important. I, I think it's important to have someone where you can share your dreams with, someone that can help you grow, someone that can share real life experiences with, and someone that looks like you. So a woman that deals with the same issues that you might deal with. And I think having that organization was a great place for me to fall back on. It's all about that being relatable, right? Absolutely. Well, Dina, thank you so much for thank stopping you. by and sharing your story. Such thank an you. inspiration. We thank appreciate you. it.